So what we're going to do now is actually change your Outlook a little bit and just change the way maybe you use uh, Microsoft Outlook with tasks and your calendar. So the next few steps and a few videos will be quite important to do together. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up to the top and we're going to click on View. And what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to click on Taskpad. So you can see that that brings my taskpad out nicely here. Now you can actually, if you click on the middle bit here where there's a line, bring that out a little bit further if you want. It's entirely up to you. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on view again and I'm going to go to taskpad view and just make sure that active tasks for selected days is uh, clicked. That way you can set tasks for tomorrow, next week and what have you and it won't appear in your box. So I'm creating my task now, I've got my subject, my due date, my start date, the priority and I've categorised it. So when I save and close that, you'll see that it actually ends up uh, in my task pad. What I'm going to do now is actually set up a task for Monday. So I've put here the start date is on Monday, that's when it's due, I've got to ring Bob from HR, it's of high importance, I've got my category under HR, and if I save and close it, you'll see that it's not appeared in my taskpad, but if I was to go to Monday, you'd see that it would actually appear there. So you can actually set dark tasks for certain dates whenever you need to do them. So that's creating up your taskpad. It's simple, it's easy, it's always in your line of sight. You can even double click here and uh, set up a task through that. So very handy tool, very useful, saves you a lot of time, and you can manage your to-do list from your calendar screen.